love me the taste of coffee first thing in the morning. Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you back to another episode of Castle of Illusion here on the channel and the last one. We went through the toy box located on this left side over here. Both Acts 1 and 2 gathered the pieces as you can see though. As you get close, you can see what you, what you collected or not. So in this case, this instance, I got both of the items here. This is the boss act, of course. And we were able to unlock the storm, which is the third area of the game. Free. Free guy for that one. Let's keep it moving. Shaking the bacon. We did complete act one in the last one. So now we're going to go ahead. Oh, I missed the uh, statue piece in that one. Uh, we're going to go ahead straight into act two. Mickey wasn't sure just how deep underground he was, but the next rainbow gem had to be there somewhere. And in this section here, what you have to do is just make sure... Ooh, crap. You have to make sure that you don't get caught up in that water there because it sends you all the way back. Just waiting for... Well, hopefully that bat comes back because there's that treasure box up there. Oh, well. Ah, well. We'll just... There we go. Set of five right here. I'll take care of that for you. And probably changes the last set of five that you're missing. Should you happen to be going through a stage and you're like, 70 out of 75? Well, where the fuck did I miss? Probably the very beginning of the stage. Got ourselves those nice golden orbs. Don't Still don't know what they're called. At the time of this recording, you know, it's just I'm doing the back recording for this, so. Oop, gotta go straight down into the water. Giant splash. <clears throat> Mickey plunged into the underwater depths of a creepy cave system, teeming with hungry skellyfish. Yeah, it's a skellyfish, all right. A fish with his head, tail, and the body made of skeletons. And in this section here, you're going to have diamonds that show up in between some of these. And you want to, if you want to grab them, that's fine. Even if you do miss it, they will come back down eventually. I'm sure. <laughs> Woo! Okay, kind of beautiful. I got one more. Oh, fucking skellyfish. Uh, got one more on this side. One more diamond on this side that we need to get. Beautiful. Oh, boy. All right. So you got a couple of blocks that will flip. Uh, if you try to land on it while it's flipping, you just fall straight through. Gotta be quick in this one. And got a chili pepper, which is nice. You come up here, you get some more diamonds. Beautiful. Up to 62, which is nice. Use the bat to get up there. Not one of those secret paths that you... Whoa. Not one of those secret paths that you... Uh, wouldn't think to look into. Yeah, this section here, the water goes down faster than you can swim up. So whenever you see a open or uh, a space in which you can avoid the water going down, take it. Not gonna exit just yet because I do want to get this up top here. Let me get that last one. Come on, let me perfect it. Oh. Yeah, let me just wait one more time. Come on, come on. Let me get that diamond. Let me get the diamond. Beautiful. Everything. 
Everything quaked and creaked. Mickey darted hither and yon for safety, but found none. Suddenly, the entire chamber flooded. Had our hero's luck finally run out? You see, this was the lair of the third master of illusion. And for this boss fight, you're going to have three sets of mermen come out at you for one, two, and three. Hence why you got the six hit points, because at first it'll be one. The second round, uh, the second time it happens, it'll be two of them. Second to third time will be three. Same pattern every time. You swim for a little bit, avoid everything. Merman starts to jump wall to wall. When he reaches the middle, jump on his head. Lather, rinse, repeat. Was Mickey seeing double? No, there truly were two of them. gang of these green killed guppies. Yellow Rainbow Gem. Reward indeed for such courage and cunning. Mickey thought of Minnie. Once he had all the gems, he'd build a rainbow bridge straight to his sweetheart. Ms. Rebel was surely shaking in her boots by now. Mickey had the third Rainbow Gem, and he was determined to get the other four. And we're going to get the other four indeed and not waste any more time on that front. As you can see now, these these uh, guards that were guarding these doors here are now gone. Meaning we can access the second floor, the top floor here. And gang some, watch some like, more pictures, paintings. Unlock another one here. 240 diamonds are required. We're at 427. We have more than enough to beat the game normally and halfway towards our 800 goal. But now let's go ahead and make our way towards the library. Act 1. Mickey found himself in a giant library. But he knew Ms. Rebel's books and bookworms were penning a not-so-happy ending for him. And here we are inside of the library, but you may have noticed something here. We're kind of not as tall as we used to be. And there are a lot of uh, books and bookworms and A's and letters and A standing for asshole, just like this guy right here. And we're just collecting all, everything we can along the way. We got ourselves the mint candies uh, that we can collect in order to um, throw at our enemies in this one. They look like those uh, candy, those uh, cheap ass candies you get at Christmas time. The ones that taste like fucking motor oil and all that shit when you bite into it. Multi assorted hard candy. Ugh, I fucking hate those. Alrighty, gotta collect some more diamonds here. Whoop, not yet, not yet. Right, that's the way to continue on with the rest of the... Of the uh, oh, I screwed up that. Uh, rest of the stage, but I want to get this diamond first. There we go, okay. Fuck you. 
Suddenly, Mickey was not alone. Mickey was in a realm of dangerous delights and scrumptious scares. All around was a sea of ice-cold milkshake, but not the sort one wanted to dive into. Yeah, so we go from a library now to dessert land, even though the stage is called the library. Uh, okay, cool. I mean, I love sweets as much as the next guy. Like, although I never had like a proper macaroon or anything like that. Now, milkshake, I got plenty of those, and uh, there's a place near me where uh, they pretty much opened up for the season, like one of those seasonal ice cream stand burger joints, one of the local ones. So the one near my the one near my house is like, oh shit, the one near me opened up for the season. Uh, well, this is uh, February by the time. Well, technically it's March by the time. Oh wait, but no, it's my sister's birthday by the time this, I'm recording this. Holy shit, I gotta make sure I wish her happy birthday, give her a present. Uh, but damn it, okay. Oh, man. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, but they're open up for the season. They like little price, like little like the food is good. Like I'm not, I'm not, I'm not like I'm gonna lie on that front, but you know, price pricing wise. It could be better. I mean, like, just a little bit better. There's a, a Donald Duck's chili pepper down there, and I just usually press, like... Yeah. I'm just holding down here. He's having a seizure. Oh, there's some diamonds I missed, son of a bitch. That's okay. That'd be a okay. All right, that's fine. This section here, you have to go around the bout of macarons and milkshake and make sure you collect all the diamonds in the process. Yeah, take a dip in the milk shake. Shake what your mama gave you. Oh, no, wait. We got to go around because there is something. There is a platform to the right over here. Not only with the, uh, uh, with the hit point of health. So a little bit further ahead. And you got yourself a nice little treasure box. So a few more diamonds here. Come on, I'm an impatient bastard. There we go. And missed the diamond on the bottom. Shit. Woo, look out. Uh, whatever. Nope, stop it. Stop it. Stop it, Mickey. It's not cool. Watch out for the macaroons in the background. Yep, I'm just taking hits where I'm not supposed to, which is not cool. I was like, yeah, no, it's fine. Actually, no, it's not. Oh, we're in the last section here, too. Only safe way to cross was hopping from cookie to cookie. Beautiful. Fourth rainbow gem was there for the taking. Hey, you! I mean, me! Stop! Shadow Mickey snuck up behind our hero, grabbed the gem, and made a culinary escape. Come back. 
And we're back inside of the library. Yeah, the, you don't necessarily have to fight a boss to get all the rainbow gems. There are two rainbow gems that you get just by simply completing the stage. Uh, you only have... You only have five boss fights in total in this game. Stand still, why don't you? Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, we got a treasure box up here. Just gotta be careful going through this section here. You will be pushed off of the screen. Like that. Alrighty. Let me just make our way towards the left. Beautiful. And that's how you get the, how you get those gems. Interesting how he disappears when uh, Jackass. Depending how uh, interesting how he disappears when the lights uh, go off. Like the nice little illusion, since we are in the castle of one. Hey, look at that! I'm looking. I'm looking at Mickey through the drunk goggles. Hey, bro, bro, you do it. Okay. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Just. It's, I just find, like, pleasure in just, like, the little things like that. Nope. There's some diamonds up here that I want to... Treasure chest I want to get up here. Hold on. Duck there. Beautiful. Get it? And we're done. Okay, so we got that. Inside of the tea. I'm gonna say, get in there. Now, when you're inside the teacup. Enjoyed tea, but he might just stick to orange juice from now on. When you're in the teacup, you have to collect the diamonds and the free guy. Once you collect the free guy, you are good to go. Uh, but you can't get sucked out of there early. It's not a one and done deal. If you happen to just miss something, you can always go back in there. Funny. Wonderful. There we go. Duck down here. And get yourself a free guy. Up to 17. Like I said, it's not that damn difficult to get free guys up in this game. In this game. That was close. Now, there is a diamond up here. Hold on. Okay, I got it. But, yeah, there's a diamond up there that's hidden, and it's like, how in the fuck are you supposed to do that? Oh, Lord, I'm down to one hit point left. There we go. Don't get pushed, and we'll be okay. Ooh, I said don't get pushed. And I almost got pushed. There we go. Another section up here. Another secret section where you can get... Oh my god. Where you can get some diamonds here. Set of five. Another T section. Well, fucking whirlpool's getting faster. That's okay. Jump back in. Woo, okay. There we go. Got the pepper. We're good. Finally. 
the green rainbow gem was his. Mickey'd endured a lot of taunting from his pesky shadow, so he couldn't resist doing a little taunting of his own. Mickey braced himself for the next sugar-coated shock from this confectionery world. And we're going to continue on with the adventure of that sugar-coated confectionery stuff in the next one. Sorry to blue ball you like this, but we're pretty much out of time for this episode. So until then, do like to thank you guys for watching. Hope you have yourselves a fantabulous day. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Good night.